Maybe in the not so distant future we'll be able to generate feature length movies based solely on prompts and some fine tuning. Until then, let's discover what's possible in AI video generation now, focusing on ByteDance's new models that could further accelerate this already fast evolving scene. I'll also cover updates from other AI video generators like Picolabs, Luma, Kling and Runway. ByteDance, the Chinese tech titan behind TikTok, has recently introduced two models, Dubao PixelDance and Dubao Seaweed. These models aim to position themselves as key competitors in AI video generation, further solidifying China's presence in the field. Why is it kind of a big deal? Pixeldance can generate 10 second videos, while Seaweed takes it up a notch with clips up to 30 seconds long. Half a minute of AI generated high quality video content, all from a single text prompt would be next level. And it's not just the length, these models seem to excel at creating complex and sequential motions, something that's been at hurdle of for other AI video generators. The Dubao model seems to handle transitions between different shots seamlessly, maintaining stability in subject and style, a challenge that has stumped many in the field. Both models are built on the DIT, the Diffusion Transformer architecture. The diffusion process in the architecture ensures smooth noise removal for generating high quality coherent frames, while the transformer efficiently captures complex spatial and temporal relationships in videos, making it ideal for video generation. This architecture allows for smooth transitions between various cinematographic techniques like zooming, panning, tilting and tracking. And the result is a quite good and consistent subject appearance and cinematography across scenes, making the videos feel cohesive and professional. However, at times the frame rate appears a bit low, causing a choppy stuttered motion effect. ByteDance's new models, Dubao PixelDance and Dubao Seaweed have been developed using the video processing and understanding expertise that ByteDance accumulated through TikTok and its video editing app CapCut. This experience has contributed to the model's capabilities in handling multi-shot transitions, maintaining content consistency and enhancing lighting for more cohesive and professional looking videos. So why is ByteDance investing so heavily in this technology? The answer lies in the booming AI video generation market in China, which is projected to reach 9.3 billion yuan, about 1.3 billion US dollars by 2026. ByteDance aims to leverage its massive user base on platforms like TikTok and its video editing app CapCut to dominate this space. This investment also includes launching new tools like the Jimang AI app, further solidifying its position in AI-driven video content creation. Moreover, there's a strategic element at play. With OpenAI restricting access to its products in mainland China, Hong Kong and Macau, there's a golden opportunity for Chinese tech firms to fill the gap. ByteDance's developments reflect a broader push to not just catch up, but potentially leapfrog US advances in AI. ByteDance has the Dubao AI family to include a music generation tool, allowing users to create personalized one-minute tracks by inputting themes, selecting music styles, moods and vocal types. Additionally, they have the Dubao Pro LLM, which can handle text inputs up to 128,000 tokens. But ByteDance isn't the only Chinese player making waves. Let's take a quick tour of what other tech giants from China are bringing to the table in the realm of AI video generation, including Kuaishu Technologies Kling, which is another strong contender in the AI video space. It has rolled out Kling AI Video Generator version 1.5, the headline feature is the 1080p HD video generation in professional mode with a whopping 95% performance boost over the previous version. This update doesn't just crank up the resolution, it enhances image quality, dynamic range and prompt relevance. Users can now enjoy sharper details, realistic lighting and more defined textures. Plus, the new motion brush feature allows for precise control over individual elements within an image, adding a layer of flexibility that's a boon for creative projects. Kling 1.5 also supports various aspect ratios and lets you generate up to 4 videos simultaneously. Despite these enhancements, Kwaishu has maintained the same pricing offering 66 free credits daily upon registration. Building on Clink's capabilities, an update released on September 30 introduced the lip-sync feature. Clink AI 
AI's lip sync function is now live. Come and try it out. Cling AI where dreams are made real. With every frame, a story to reveal. It's all or nothing really got a way of driving me crazy. I need somebody to hear. This lip sync and motion brush features already exist in Runway Gen 3, so Kling seems to be directly competing with Gen 3's capabilities. I hope video to video will also appear soon. Additionally, the new community section is now live on Kling AI's official website, encouraging users to share their creations. The platform rewards quality materials and films, offering up to 666 credits for short films, 36 credits for videos and 6 credits for images upon passing the official review. This community feature not only promotes creativity, but also provides a hub for creators to showcase their work and earn rewards. API platform access has been fully opened, providing tools for video generation, image generation and virtual try-on capabilities. Next we have Minimax AI, a startup with its text-to-video platform Video01. This tool generates 6 second videos in 720p HD resolution from text prompts and is currently free to use on their website. While the platform is currently limited to 6 second clips, there are plans to extend this to 10 seconds. Backed by 600 million in funding led by Alibaba, with participation from Tencent, Minimax is focusing on producing high resolution content through its Video01 platform. Users can try Video01 in English or Chinese, but better results are reportedly achieved with Mandarin prompts. The platform promises future enhancements like longer videos and image-to-video capabilities. I'd like to mention that this is the best quality video generator I tried, offering impressive results, while it currently has limited control options only supporting text-to-video generation. The service is free for now, with no details on future pricing. Despite these limitations, this is one of the few tools alongside Kling that I would consider paying for on a regular subscription basis. Rhinebase Gen 3 Alpha offers a powerful video-to-video -video feature, allowing users to transform their footage with creative flexibility. This feature has a structured transformation slider that lets users decide how much the final output adheres to the original video. It supports various styles, including 3D cartoon and claymation, enabling a wide range of visual effects. Additionally, users can incorporate text, image and video inputs, making it versatile for different creative projects. The platform charges credits based on video length, adding cost-effectiveness to its robust set of tools. This video-to-video -video feature truly takes creative control to the next level. This means that you can shoot a low-quality clip of yourself and transform it into a completely different character, like a female protagonist, or take a simple, untextured scene from Blender and elevate it to a high-quality, fully rendered video. Luma Dream Machine 1.5 is set to bring several key updates to its AI video generation model. The latest version claims to enhance realism, motion following and prompt understanding. It promises more lifelike human movements and refined text-to-video capabilities, supposedly allowing for more accurate text rendering. They also state that users can generate elements like logo screens, end boards or graphics directly from text prompts. Additionally, they boast about improved speed, with 5 seconds of video generation taking about 2 minutes, and say it offers greater consistency in character motion throughout video generation, even in extended clips. Now let's turn our attention to Pika Labs, an early player in AI video generation. After initially gaining attention with their 1.0 text-to-video platform, they lost momentum as newer platforms like Runway and Kling dominated the scene. Now with the launch of Pika 1.5, they are attempting to make a comeback, offering a fresh approach to the market. With Pika 1.5, they are introducing Pika Effects, a suite of physics-defying special effects that aims to create visual effects from prompts. These effects include Explode it, Shatter your subject into countless pieces, melt it, watch objects liquefy before your eyes, crush it, compress elements if under immense pressure, inflate it, make items expand in size and volume, cakeify it, 
turn any object into a hyper-realistic cake version, slicing into it to reveal layers. The platform automatically identifies subjects or objects within the video and seamlessly applies the chosen effect. In my opinion, from all these tools, the most exciting feature is video to video from Runway and the best quality right now is what Minimax offers.